Welcome back to Mountain News this morning. We're joined now by meteorologist Brandon Orr. Shaping up to be a cold weekend, but I saw Thursday there's some warmer temperatures coming our way. There is some warmer air, and it's going to be warmer tomorrow, even though we're seeing temperatures near average. It's warmer than what we saw yesterday. And there's some warmer air on the way. There's a lot of ups and downs in the seven-day forecast as far as temperatures go, and really as far as rain and precipitation but goes as well. You know what? At least there's no snow. We haven't had that big snowstorm this year. We really haven't had one yet. Keep your well, fingers crossed. Yeah, for now, at least. A right. lot of our big snowstorms also come in February and also into March. Right. So we still have some winter to go, even though we're past the, the middle point of winter, but it looks pretty nice outside right now. You can enjoy the nice sunrise out towards Stonecrest Golf Course in northern Floyd County, right around Prestonsburg. In fact, you can see there's a little bit of leftover snow on the ground that fell yesterday morning. We had that brief heavy snow shower that pushed through Prestonsburg and Pikeville and laid down a quick coating. And some of that is still hanging around in there and some of the bushes and such. And a lot of it will melt today once we get the sun up and these temperatures into the middle 40s. Now you can see pinpoint Doppler is mainly dry across eastern Kentucky. But these are the uh, winter storm warnings that we're talking about. This area in pink from Chicago, northern Illinois, northern Indiana and even all the way into Ohio and portions of the Northeast have winter weather advisories. That's this area in white as this storm system continues to push up against the colder air to our north. Here in eastern Kentucky, we're actually going to be on the southern end of the storm system. So southerly winds will usher in a significantly warmer air mass than what we're seeing right now. It's just going to take a little bit to do so. So we have a cold start to the weekend. Still into the upper teens in many locations, 20 degrees now in Breathitt County as some of these high thin clouds start to push in. That's a little bit of gray moving in from western Kentucky. That's going to continue to expand as we go across the afternoon. So right now we're seeing some sunshine as the sun starts to rise, but we won't see too much of the sunset. We may see a little bit behind some of the broken clouds that are starting to push out ahead of this storm system. A lot of moisture moving up with this one as well, so we could see some rainfall amounts. Nothing too concerning, but we could see some up to a half inch in some locations that see some of the heavier rain showers. So warm air off towards the west. That's going to start to move in during the day today and especially during the day on Sunday. That's when you're really going to start to feel the warmer air is the latter half of the weekend. So temperatures were pretty close to average for this time of year. Middle 40s in most locations. Some of the showers start to push in early Sunday morning. If they move in soon enough, we could see a light wintry mix to start out Sunday morning. We're going to be watching it carefully because it could stick to the roads in some locations, but for the most part, it's going to be majority rain as we get into the afternoon hours. Watch how far up the temperatures go with the southerly winds. Future view has it into the lower 50s. I think many of us will stick right around 50 degrees with the rain moving through. This is a cold front, that area of darker green you see there. A little pop of rain starts to push on through during late Sunday night into early Monday morning. Colder air moves in behind that, and this is when we start to see our next chance for some snow showers Monday morning. Could see some light accumulations out of that, but for the most part, many of us, I think, will just see a dusting, if that, if that at all. So not too much in the way of snowfall, getting colder as we get towards the uh, first part of the week. So that's it, 29 degrees from Monday behind that storm system. Pretty chilly, but another one moves through and it bumps our temperatures up to around 50 degrees by Wednesday. Could see an evening shower on Wednesday and a light mix of rain and snow on Thursday. And then temperatures boost back down to around 31 degrees to end out the work week. So lots of ups and downs. That's what I was talking about, ups and downs with those temperatures. You can see 29 on Monday, but two days later, we're up towards 50 again. Well, thank you, Brandon. I noticed uh, you were talking about a little bit of sun peeking through this morning, and then you saw it on the seven day, maybe a little.